Hey everyone, today we're going to be talking about island biogeography and uh, what we have here is a graph um, on the y-axis we're going to have rate of immigration and to our right we're going to have rate of extinction And on the x-axis, we're going to have the number of species on an island. And so we'll start with uh, a couple of uh, models. So basically, what this uh, theory of um, island biogeography is is um, how the number of species on an island will affect uh, an extinction rate um, and that's all dependent on whether or not uh, the island is large or small um, whether or not it's far and close to the mainland so we'll look at those ratios so we're gonna look at the first one which will be um, having a species close to a mainland in a large island. So we can see that the rate of immigration is high, the probability of immigrating is high, but uh, the rate of extinction is not too low or too high. Uh, it's just kind of in between here um, and that's because if a species is close to the mainland um, and uh, there's a large island uh, then the rate of immigration will increase uh, since the species is since the island is close to the mainland um, now we'll look at an example of having uh, an island far from the mainland and with a small island So you can see here, um, if, if the species, if the island, um, is far from the mainland, um, rate of immigration uh, is pretty low, and then the small island's uh, rate of extinction is high, uh, because one, the population is smaller um, on the small island, and two, um, it is far from the mainland, so it's not going to immigrate very often. And then we can look at some points that are uh, close to mainland and being a small island. So if it's close to the mainland, it'll be about there. Um, and you will have a small island that has a large rate of extinction. And the reason for that being is because um, if the island is close to the mainland, um, then the rate of immigration is going to be high. But if it's a small island, then the rate of extinction will also be high because of the population size. Um, and so let's look at one last example of a combination of a species being far from the mainland, which will have a small Im immigration rate. And then it being the species being on a large island, which will also have a low extinction rate. This is because the species is far from the mainland, so it's not going to uh, immigrate as much. And because it, it has such a large island population, the rate of extinction will be low. I hope this video uh, found you well, and I hope that you learned uh, great amount of deal on island biogeography. Thank you. Goodbye.